Okay, and so now I'm going to say, um, I'm going to add in this description here and um, then some tags. Um, now, this uh, pops up, it says, um, may have some uh, audio video sync issues. Now, I know it doesn't, so I'm not worried about that. Um, that's not a big deal. So I'm going to go ahead and um, then uh, put this in here. Okay, so um, now I've uh, gone ahead and changed the title to make it relevant um, to the uh, uh, search terms that I want. And um, then I've uh, put in a uh, clickable link here um, to the website uh, for Freelancer. Um, and then I'm also putting in uh, a link here. Um, now I need this video um, to be uh, uploaded and processed um, so that um, I can then link it back to the video. Um, and so I'm going to go ahead and um, copy that. All right, so I'm going to take my video and bring it in here and um, scroll down to uh, where I want this to go. I'm going to make sure that my um, video is going to be centered. Um, I just use my um, handy dandy tab here and uh, I'm going to put in my video URL and it's going to embed it. I've already done that. It's right here. And um, so we're going to uh, preview it real quick, make sure it looks the way it's supposed to look. All right, and scroll down and here's our video how to make money as a freelancer using freelance.com um, so that's what we want right there um, and so now I'm going to go back to uh, my post and um, scroll down and um, I'm gonna put down here um, SEO video coming soon okay and um, hit publish and so um, that's going to um, pop up here um, shortly but um, I'm gonna go ahead and um, get this um, get this link here and then I'm gonna go to um, YouTube and um, so then um, put this in and um, All right, so um, now we have uh, this link here, and uh, this should be a clickable link. And so um, now that we're done um, with that, we're going to go and we're going to pick one of these uh, thumbnails. Um, I think I like that one the best. Um, and then we're going to choose our category, and we're going to go to what we want for our category. Uh, how to. There we go. All right, so um, we've got that. And um, we're going to go ahead and um, okay. So um, now that I've got my freelancer.com video done, um, the video walkthrough, I'm going to go ahead and uh, upload this here and then show you a little bit of what I'm doing with the SEO part. So uh, we're going to go ahead and um, uh, upload this, and um, there we go. So now I'm going to change this so that it matches the um, uh, keywords that I want. Um, Okay, so for the uh, SEO part of this, um, we've uploaded uh, this video we took for uh, Freelancer, uh, the walkthrough here, and we've uploaded it here uh, using uh, the title as um, one of our keywords. It matches um, uh, pretty closely um, with our uh, title of our uh, um, blog post here. Um, and then we, uh, we filled out um, the uh, description of it, and so we, um, we put a clickable link here in the description um, for Freelancer and then another clickable link um, directly to the post on the website. Um, and then we, we put a couple tags in it here. And I may put a couple more tags. But um, and this right here um, it is the uh, most important part of this. Um, now, we've also embedded this in the... Um, in the uh, post here, right? So um, we have this here, and uh, we've got this boom how to make money using freelancer.com to build a business. And um, so we've got that there so that people can watch it, but also so that Google can tag that this has a video in it. Um, there's a nice little uh, Google SEO double dip that happens um, it, because uh, it says that video, that the way Google looks at it, a video is um, more interesting than. Um, 
just pictures or text and so anything that has video in it is um, going to get an extra um, SEO bump and especially if it's on uh, YouTube um, because YouTube is uh, owned by Google so um, because they own it and they make the rules uh, they can play like that so now there's uh, one more thing that we're gonna do here I'm gonna take the URL for uh, this video here and I'm going to come back over here and I'm going to find um, the keywords that I want um, this um, video to rank for and I'm going to um, link it to that so I'm going to hit edit post here here and we're just going to um, click this and we're going to link it and we're going to go there open a new window so basically um, that's a um, search phrase that I want the uh, YouTube video to rank for and so I'm gonna copy it there so if they um, if they click that that will take them to um, the YouTube video and so that will help um, that will help the uh, YouTube video rank there so Um, and then here we go. We're going to do this one as well. Um, all right. So that's uh, two of those, and this all goes on um, how I plan on uh, getting my uh, entry ranked. Um, okay. So uh, there's that. So we have um, two of those, and um, so that's good for that. Um, and uh, so I'm going to hit um, update. Okay. And then this goes to uh, the YouTube video, and that goes to the YouTube video as well. All right, so um, that part is taken care of, um, and so um, we are going to now um, start um, building this out a little bit and helping to drive um, some links to um, our, uh, our um, page here that we want people to go to. So I'm um, going to uh, pause this real quick and hop over to uh, Facebook, and then um, we'll go from there and uh, continue. All right, so now we are at the um, Singletree uh, Facebook page. All right, now um, what this does is this gives us a, a clickable link here um, to the um, page, and um, the reason that's important is we're going to... Um, we're going to pin this to the top so that folks see it. Um, the reason that this is important is um, it has to do with um, something called PageRank. And so um, let me uh, pull up uh, PageRank. Um, oh, there we go. Um, so let me pull up uh, some PageRank stuff real quick and um, show you um, why this is important. Okay, so let's talk about why it's important to um, have links coming from Facebook um, and from YouTube um, and from, uh, we'll have links coming from uh, LinkedIn um, as well and we're also going to use the uh, Google Plus and um, uh, Google Local uh, platform as well. Um, so here's why. The reason is um, Google gives um, uh, search rankings based on um, the page rank of the page, pages that those uh, links come from. So, for example, um, in order to be a page rank 10, which is what um, uh, Facebook and um, uh, Google and uh, YouTube, etc., are, you need 84 million links coming from a page rank one. Okay, so obviously um, it, it's kind of difficult to be a page rank 10, um, and we really don't have time. To go around and um, uh, set up um, a bunch of different websites to bounce links back and forth to um, try and get our page, uh, that particular page, ranked really highly. So, what we're going to do is we're going to take advantage of using uh, PageRank 10 pages and using links from there to help boost our um, rating for that particular page. So, as you can see here, um, it's it's obviously a lot easier to get your page ranked using um, backlinks from 
uh, PageRank 10. So for example, um, one link from PageRank 10 um, is uh, the equivalent of having roughly 2.8 million uh, backlinks from PageRank 1. So uh, this is what we're doing. Instead of trying to build a whole bunch of websites to bounce links back and forth, we're just going straight to PageRank 10s and getting links there. So um, that's how and why we're doing that. And so um, now we are going to um, uh, continue on our merry little way, but I want to give you a brief explanation of why it is we're doing what we're doing. Okay?